hi guys uh, welcome back to my tutorial so today in my tutorial I will talk about the SSH service so many times like uh, we see that uh, the SSH port number is 22 but in, in our organization we see that we the port number is customized to something else to enable the security you know to so to achieve that I will show you how you can do that so in this tutorial I'll show you how to start the SSH service in your system how to customize it to um, work on certain port number other than 22 which is the default uh, so and how can we stop the service like that so we'll go, st we'll go step by step so first of all uh, we'll see if it is uh, already installed on your system so you have to be the root user to so, uh, configure SSH on your system right so uh, there is a command called service service SSH D SSH D is the service name for SSH so if you see this uh, if you see this uh, uh, service SSH it's not found right it is saying it is not found if I if I try to start it saying it is not found right which means that SSH is not installed in the system so let's try to install it so you have to be uh, okay let's install it as a root user so let's install uh, so to install the SSH you have to install this module called open open SSH server so once you install this it will uh, enable it will configure the SSH D uh, service on your system right so you can see it is installing open SSH server right let's see if it is installed now okay you can see that so now I can if I run this service SSH D which is the service name and then start okay now I have started the SSH service right let's see the status like uh, how is it working okay so if you see the configuration now it is showing that the service open SSS is running or it is listening on the port number 60022 okay so which I have already uh, modified it so I'll show you how to you know customize it to something else other than the 22 port number okay because now uh, if you uh, if you have a program let's say uh, just ignore the program this is a python program which i'm trying to connect so if you simply give 22 you, you will not be able to connect to the server unable to connect to port 22 because our server is configured to run ssh on the port number 60022 okay this is the purpose this is the uh, the purpose is to enhance the security of the system so you have to go to edc ssh okay and then there will be a file called ssh dconfig you have to open that file if once you open that file you have this uh, field called port number right so by default this is 22 right if you save it okay and then you can you can start you can restart you, any any changes you make you have to restart the service let's restart the service okay now my service is restarted as such now let's try to see the status so if you see the status now so currently it is running on the default port which is 22 so if I run this program now it will be able to connect to my system right it is connecting finished with exit port 0 so it is connecting now so 22 is my default port if I want to change it to anything which as per our own choice like as per the organization choice so we can make it anything like you know uh, let's say I want to change the port number for the organization specific let's make it 500 or something okay so if you restart the service again if you if you check the status it is listening on the port numbers 500 
okay so if you try to execute it you won't be able to connect to the server that's the purpose so if you now you have you know that the what is the port number where the where your SSS is running so it's the only you who can connect to the system so if you give this port number now you should be able to connect to the system right so it's it's it towards it so this is how you can customize the port number of uh, SSH in your system so this is a very small trick and this is very really, really very useful for the people and for really useful to enhance the security so that's all guys uh, thanks for watching please subscribe my channel which is linux unix ax1 for you thanks for watching